Hello, my name is Grace. Today I will read the Bible story. The Bible story name is Brave Million. <coughs> I will read the Bible story. Wait, wait. Million was the Israel girl. Her family lived in Egypt. The parable of Egypt did not like the people of Israel. The parable ordered his man to kill all the Israel's baby boy. William's mother had a lovely baby boy. She had the baby in and raised him. As the boy grew, she couldn't hide her. What is this? She couldn't hide him any longer. She laid her son in a basket and placed in the river. I will be with baby, William. William was a brave girl. William followed the basket, uh, the basket, securely. The baby cried in the basket. Um, in the basket, the baby cried in the basket. A woman came to the river to take a bath. She was a princess of Egypt. Look at the basket. She was surprised to see the baby. In a basket, I will raise this cup baby myself. The princess said, I will call this baby Moses because I took him out of the water. Moses means a child out of the water. I need a nurse. Worried, worried. The princess, Miriam, was watching everything. She ran to the princess and said, I know a woman, she, she can help you. My mother can take care of beta baby, said William. The princess said yes, and William wrote to her mother. The princess asked her, I will pay you for nursing the baby. The mother was very happy to raise her own baby openly. Thank you. You are such a brave girl, Miriam said the mother. I will read one more story. 
Moses saw the families of the bush. Moses became 40 years old. Moses knew that he was an Israel living in Egypt. One day he saw a Egypt hit a hit an Israel. One day he saw a uh, sorry he was mad and killed the Egyptian the Egyptian Pharaoh turned to catch Moses. Moses was Moses run away. Time has passed it. Moses got married and become a shepherd. Moses was 80 years old. Moses was sad. He missed the people of Israel in Egypt. They were slaves in Egypt. Moses was talking, taking care of his sheep. He saw that he was sad because of the Israel in Egypt. Moses said to himself, My people are suffering all day because of the king of Egypt who can help them. Moses was talking, taking care of his sheep one day. Sometimes strange it happened. They, then a bush was on fire, but it was not burning. God spoke to Moses from the bush. Go back to Egypt, bring my people out of Egypt. You will go into Canaan as I promised. To Abraham long time ago. Moses was afraid. He didn't want to do this job. He knew the Pharaoh would try to kill him, but God showed miracles to. In Krogus Moses, God also led his brother Aaron to go with him. Aaron spoke well. Oh, Moses is also wearing a, a red shirt. I am also wearing the red shirt. It's same, same to same class. Moses Coragoni went to Egypt. Moses was going to bring God's people out of Egypt. Moses was going to do as God said. Wow. I will read one more story. The king said no. Let's pe let God's people go. Moses said We wanted to leave Egypt to worship God. Please let my people go now. No, said Pharaoh. God said you must let us go, said Moses again. I don't care what your God says, said the stubborn the Pharaoh.
Pharaoh made the Israel mark hard. The people of Israel cannot have enough time to eat. God told Moses that to do Pharaoh will be mean to you and you and the people. Don't worry. They will soon know that I am the Lord of the Israel. Moses said, Let my people go many times, but the king didn't listen to God. No, said the king, your people has to work for me. Trouble things began to happen in Egypt. The longest river in Egypt was covered up to blood. Frogs were everywhere in Egypt, but became gentle and received felices came all over. There's a frog. The water has been... <coughs> blood and there is some um, flies after nine trouble distenders one day last horrible thing happened the first born son in egypt at last parallel called moses and Aaron. Go, said the king, take your people out of Egypt. The king was not stubborn sur anymore. God showed that he is great, greater than the king. Yes, I read two story. One story name is... Mm. A brave and brave million, and Moses saw the flames of the bush, and the king says, No, it was bad, then bye.